Hi there and welcome. In today's video, I'm going to be patching up. It's a butt area on a pair of my jeans and they're just getting a bit thin. So I'm going to put some patches on them to be basically double layer the fabric. But then what I'm going to do is because I've made like these patches, which I've frayed the edges and I've pressed one side because I'm going to be sewing that side on the seam that's running down the center of the jeans. But I've also made some little frayed patches that I'm going to be putting basically all over the jeans in places after I've got the patches on where they need to be. So I'm going to show you first of all where you can just see here where it's like bobbling and um, getting thinner. So I've just put two patches and I'm going to put it over the seam there and make sure that it's going to be covering the bit that's going thin and then the same on the opposite side and then when i've got that stitched on i'm going to actually unpick this side of the leg so that i can open the leg out and then position where i want these patches to be so i'm going to start by pinning these in place first so i've just got the jeans in place let me just get these so that I can place these patches in place and get them pinned on. Yeah, that will be perfect for that one. So let me just get this pinned on there. Let me get this other side pinned on. Make sure that that kind of is flat under there. Right, so my first job then is to literally just go and stitch these on. Let's get this undone so I can get in. I have got a 110 needle in my uh, machine as well to cope with the thickness. Right, so let me do this one first on this side. Take that pin out. on that really thick bit and just doing that by hand laying this down flat and I'm just going to follow the shape of that patch to the next one right okay get that to come over there that track and I'm 
just stitching inside of where that fraying is. Just cut that thread there. Get this flat. So I'm just going to get all these threads cut. Let me just get this from under. The threads cut inside. Yep. And then that is the patches underneath. So the sides are unpicked and I've just placed the patches on. What I've basically done is I've put two, four on the front on each side. And I've just made sure that where there's a blue there and a white there, I've got it the opposite side on the opposite leg. And they're in similar-ish positions. And then on the back, again, you've got four on each side. So I'm going to go to the duke i'm going to actually stitch round these in orange thread to match the orange on basically all the seams let's get in position and by opening the seams you're going to get in very easy to stitch patches on your jeans right let's get this one and again i'm just stitching just inside where it's frayed Do a back tack. So then I'm just going to move down to the next one on the leg and I'll cut the threads after. Right, I'll move down to the next one. this leg
and all the time making sure that it's nice and smooth underneath where the patch is. Right, so that's one leg done. So at this point, I'm going to just get all the cottons snipped off. And that is the patches stitched on the first leg. So I'm going to do the other the other three sides, which is two on the opposite leg and this side off camera. And I'm just going to repeat the process that I've just done. So all the patches are stitched on in place. So what I'm going to do now then, I'm going to turn them inside out and stitch those outside legs back up. Give a good back tack there at the start. And I'm just going to do a really good back tack when I get to that end. Get those. I'm snipped off at this end. And what I love about these patches is I love that they've got two blue frayed sides and then two white. So I'm going to go and press these, try them on for you, and then we'll take a look at how they look. All right, so I've just got a bit of denim here to show you about how you can free it. You just get the edge and then you just keep pulling these pieces of thread. Not taking them off the opposite side. And you're just pulling the edge of this thread. That'll pull down the opposite side. And then you're getting this edge. And again, it's those threads that you're pulling to give you your frayed edges. And then again, you just keep going round until you've got the amount of fraying that you want. You can see there it's pretty easy to do you just go in keep taking it off uh, the more you want to your frame to be so i think these have turned out pretty cute guys you can't see at the bottom here where the patches are on the front there's a little bit of fraying but it doesn't shout out repair and because i've put these other patches on even that bit of fraying blends in with the patches. Now, I could have took the hems of the jeans off and frayed those, and that would have gone in, but I do like to wear these jeans with deep turnips on. But the denim, the denim that I actually got is from a, a denim jacket that I shortened for myself, and I've just used that fabric to make the patches. But sometimes when we're clearing, jeans out whether it be myself or my daughters they don't always make it to the charity shop because i keep some just to use the denim for if a project comes up so you can see from that guys it's an easy easy solution to repairing those jeans that's you know getting a bit thin so if you've liked this video guys please give it a thumbs up because it does help me on youtube thanks for watching till next time bye for now